My name is Matt Dobbins. I'm the head pro at the Meadowbrook Club, and I'm here to help you hit the ball longer through my four keys that helped me win the 2019 Met Open Championship. The first key to hitting the ball longer is ensuring that you have a strong grip. Anytime you start moving your body faster, it becomes more difficult to bring the club face around a square at impact. So I suggest putting your left hand on top of the grip, not underneath it. You can see two knuckles on your left hand. Placing your right hand in a mirror position so it's more underneath the grip so that you can see the fingernail of your middle and ring finger. If you have two knuckles visible on your left hand, and you can see two fingernails on your right hand, you know your grip is strong enough to swing fast. The next step to hitting longer drives is making a bigger arc. And the key to making a bigger arc is increasing the length of your pivot. The best way to do that is to allow all of the pieces of your body to move in such a way that allows your trunk to maximize its rotation. I like to work on that with the best training aid in golf, a stick. I place the stick at a 45 degree angle. In the middle of my stance, I put the club on my shoulder joints and I try and match the two angles. So you'll notice the shaft on the driver is on top of the shaft on the ground. The end of the club is pointing downward. It is not pointing upward. This position might be hard to achieve, but it'll be easier if you let your knees move, allow your hips to move, and that's gonna free up your trunk to get this shaft to match up with the one on the ground. Now that you've made a big pivot, the third key to hitting the ball longer is doing the right thing through the hit. As you're approaching impact, your hands will bottom out. The lowest point in the swing will be right in front of the right thigh. This will be the lowest your hands get in the golf swing. From this point on, you should feel an aggressive rise in the grip, a rise in your belt buckle, and a left shoulder that's working up and back as hard as you can. Now the last piece of longer drives is using your hands effectively. You need to allow the right hand to go from a bent position to a flat position, and it needs to be done very aggressively. I am allowing my right wrist to extend, and that's giving me almost a punching feeling into the hit. As all my body pieces are rising, my hands are playing along by throwing the club head into the ball. This is gonna help get speed into the club head and it's gonna help the club head rise into the golf ball as opposed to descent. So get your grip strong, maximize your pivot, let your body rise and move your hands aggressively, letting your wrist angles go. If you do those four things, I guarantee you'll hit it longer.